And so I had the privilege of shooting some time lapses with the Sumi Rays, which was really, really nice on a mirrorless camera to be able to see how that character played out, even in a full frame image. And I found that it held up really, really well. Uh, I often shoot with C&E lenses for a lot of our internal production stuff as they're just very quick and reliable and because we often are shooting on Canon cameras like the C300 Mark II, it makes it very quick and easy for those colors uh, to play nice together and, and come out really nice and rich on screen. The Sumi Rays fit into that mix very well, but being so familiar with the C&Es, I can very quickly identify the differences between the two and the kind of nuance in that focus roll off and the highlight areas that you get with the Sumi Rays. I also am a big fan of how sharp they are wide open. Your depth of field is gonna be very, very shallow, but you can maintain a really, really nice crisp focus even when wide open.